What's up, everybody? This is uh, Brandon Park from Tabletop Commands. Hi, and Jesus from Dream Production. And we are back with episode three of Tabletop Commands, where sure. we're going to be playing some Commander. Uh, and for starting today, my Commander is Zerger Hell Smasher. My goal for today is to cream everybody, pretty much smash through everybody. I don't care what you're doing as long as I can deal damage to you and kill you. That sounds mean. Oh, it is mean. Uh, I have. I mean, not too. She's she's the whispering one. No, the face shifter. My bad. Uh, she looks pretty dope. That's why I got her. I'm talking and you're like <laughs> in my shot. Yes, I am. Thank you. Uh, I'm gonna be blinking. I've never actually played a blink deck. Let's roll off to see who goes first. For sure. All right. What do you got? 18. That's bullshit. That's not. It's um. Oh look. I got 10. All right. Looks like I go first if I choose to. If I decide that I have enough lands. This comes in tap, go. Yeah. I'm gonna play a mountain. I'm on What? You already summoned me something? And I'm gonna summon a soul ring. Oh. oh, that's really good for the first. Like two mana. It does. Pass my turn. I don't like what you did there. Hey, look, I got another card that this also don't know what it does. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, it doesn't, oh. Um, <laughs> sure, why not? Uh, this comes in tap, but I get to scry one. Hey. So. That's what I scribed. Um, you can't cheat. Pass turn. Summon Exodion. The blue Oh yeah. Uh, it's not possible. No one's ever been able to call him Exodia. Obliterate. Is that what he says? <laughs> I don't know. I think that's what he, uh, I think okay. that's what he said. I don't play Cordulus. Stop. No. I'm never stop. gonna stop. So okay. as long as Cordulus is equipped, it has double strike. Okay. He's not equipped. But he's ill-equipped. I'm not done shit. You have one mana. What are you gonna do? What do you mean? I got three mana. I know. Stop thinking about that. Just forget that you have. I'm gonna it. play a four blair's blade. Fortunately, I can't equip it because the equip cost is no three. But the creature gets a plus three, plus zero, and has vigilance, vigilance, and trample. And tap. Okay. Tap two. I'm going to cast. Look at the top three cards. Larry, put one of those into your hand, and put the other one. <clears throat> On top of your library, one on the bottom. Okay. So I get to kind of manipulate what I want. This goes to the bottom, this goes next. Okay. Shenanigans again start next turn. Oh, it does. All right. Uh, yeah, because oh, I'm tapped out, man. I'm going to gain a life. What? Tap and equip that. Okay. You're giving a plus three and double strike. So now I'm swinging at you for Six. eight damage. Eight. Because it's double strike, and that's three. So it gives it a four. Oh, I thought it was a, sorry. I thought it was a, a higher number. Okay. So eight total. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, it has vigilance. What am I tapping? Eight. All right. <clears throat> okay. By the way, this is a this is a Voltron deck, guys. By the way, this is a I don't know what I'm doing deck. It comes in. Ba -da -da, ba -da -da, ba -da -da. Tap. And you start manipulating stuff. All right. That was so um, funny, dude. Hmm, hmm. Every time I see that the gold ring on your finger, I don't know why, but I keep on like it, it makes me think that maybe secretly behind the scenes you got like a secret wife that nobody knows about. Is that the case, Jesus? What? You got a wife that nobody knows about? Oh, oh, uh, yeah. All the time. Shit. This this isn't how you play her. Okay, sure. I'm gonna have faith in my deck. All right. <laughs> bring out my commander. My plus one. This girl. So she's at four now. I draw a card. Mm hmm. Then I get to put a card back from top of the library. Okay. I will choose to put that. I'll put back you. Okay. Uh, I'm all tapped out. That pass room. Okay. This is one of the things I did see that this deck is slow. It has too many high cost cards. Because I'm playing it right out. Like I've modified nothing from the deck. So now I'm bringing in Zerkle Hell Smasher, my commander. Okay. He has haste, and he's actually indestructible since it's my turn. Okay. And whenever he deals damage, uh, whenever a creature is dealt damage by Zerber Hell Smasher this turn and dies, I get to put a plus one, plus one counter on him. Okay. So I'm going to swing with seven and four at you. So you take seven commander damage, and then eight damage from that. Okay. And Literally can't do anything. <clears throat> All right, draw a card. Is it tap? All my lands come to tap. That's another thing that sucks about this. I'll plus one her again. Draw a card. Summon her. Exile your commander. 
Four. Exile target creature. Just comes in, exile target creature. You get a 1-1 one, one token in its place. Here's a 1-1 one, one token in its place. That's all I can do. Okay. Yeah. That's not a creature, though. It's just a spell, right? Well, it, it's a shapeshifter. Change the this card is every creature type. Exile target creature. Its controller creates a 1-1 color shapeshifter token with changeling. So you have a 1-1 one, one shapeshifter? No, you do, because it's controller. Do. Okay. That's just weird, though, because like, there's no power or toughness yeah, on it. Yeah, I'm not sure about that, to be honest. I don't, I don't think that stays in the field, man. Probably not, I guess. Because, I mean, there's just no attack or uh, defense on it. Okay, so it's not a creature. Okay. So it goes bye-bye. All right, well, that sucks, because that's exactly what I didn't want. Um... <sighs> that's 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 it, man. I got nothing. Wait, right. does this? Did I summon this? No, that was last turn. So I actually do have two mana. So I'm gonna sorcery reveal tough cards until I get a non land and then put all in its hand. Non land, non land, land. Okay. Then put him into my hand. I didn't put a land this turn, so I will put a land there. Okay. And then I will pass my turn. Uh, yeah. I had to read a card. So I'm gonna tap out. Okay. Put that on silence, please. It was on silence. Put it on. <laughs> yeah. I'll be serious. It was on silence. It's fine. Uh, I'm gonna fall Titans and deal that much damage to you. How much is it? It's two, four, five, six, seven. Nope, it's not. Uh, is one red, it one. Two damage. Plus that. That counts as mana. So, th yeah, this is two mana, right? Yeah. So, one, one two. two. So, two damage. Two damage? Okay. Yeah. Two damage, and then swing at you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. It's going to be right there. All right. Pester? Yeah. Okay. Well, actually, uh, actually no, I was going to swing that one one as well. Okay. okay. I'm, I'm dead next round. There's nothing I can do. You don't. This is not how I should play it. This is how I'm gonna play it. Summon him. She's a six. All right. Draw a card. Need to put a card back. Nope, nope, connect, you connect. Sure, this goes back just because it doesn't matter for right now. Then I'm going to I have a blocker, that's it. Also right one more round. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna attribute the hunger, sacrifice that, and then gain uh, two life on that. Damn. So I mean, that sucks. Two. Okay. Then. That sucks a lot. Play Kemba, Kai Regent. Mm hmm. And then swing for eight and nine damage. I don't wanna do this. Kill them. Fortify. That's cool. I'll swing take one. one. Yeah. Man, I don't want to do it. What does he do? So, the video key, you put a 2 2 white ca uh, cat creature token onto the battlefield for each equipment attached to her. Uh, so, I can automatically, actually, I can automatically put that to that because of its effect. It says when a creature dies, equip attach it. it. Okay, okay. Yeah, so to equip the last turn. Yeah, so she is a 3 2 is 4 5. She's a 5 4. Okay. I'm going to minus 6 her. Mm -hmm. I'm going to choose you. All, right. All your cards. Or non lands come to my side of the field. I'm sorry, it's just that. Yep. And you get nothing. I'm going to resummon <clears throat> her since she died. Cost one more mana to summon. Four. Draw a card. Oh, oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. I would need one more mana. Ah, oh, that's really good. I will cast you. So you can produce a mana as an artifact. I either can tap for colors or I can scry one. So, you don't get no cats, but I will swing at you for five. Five. One, and that's two, vigilance. Three, okay. Three, four, five. Okay. Yeah. That's that's all I can do right now. Right. I hate that it went so far down before I can barely start to do effect. And I'm not even using her correctly. I'm, I haven't blinked yet. Look, you're... <laughs> yeah. Dude, it's on, I swear to God. Oh, that's fine. Let me see what I can do. What can you do, my friend? Oh, this also is mine.
Oh. If that's true. I want to ruin his path down, destroy it. So what, you can't destroy have it. Destroy what? Target creature or planeswalker. Destroy target creature or planeswalker. That creature dies. Oh, that sucks. And then. Nope. It's my side of the field. No, it has to be attached to a creature when it dies, but. If it's not attached to a creature, if I'm not mistaken, an artifact will go to the graveyard. I think it has to be attached. No. I don't think so. I'm gonna look up the ruling. I think it just stays there. That's my ruling because it benefits me. <laughs> if there's no targets for the triggered ability of Force Planes, its ability targets becomes illegal. Force Ability remains on the battlefield unattached. So I think I have to recast it then. Yeah. So it's on the battlefield. So technically it stays on my side. Okay. Alright, cool. My guy, yeah. your turn. I'm just, uh, I'm gonna play that. Okay. And then pass. What does it do? Just gives you plus one. Plus one, plus one. Oh, finally, a good card. Okay. Oh my god, alright. I don't think I can do both at one time. So I wanna summon her first. She's the better of the two. Because I technically have enough mana to do what I need to do. Okay. So, black, white, okay. And then one, two. Summon my legendary creature. Um, so whenever she attacks, I reveal a top card of my library. If its converted cost is odd, I automatically put it on the field. If it's even, I just draw it. Gotcha. Okay, cool. And then I have technically two, three, four, five more mana. Tap three. Okay. Now I have two more mana. I'm going to, I don't have anything to blink, so I'm gonna plus five for draw card. What do I wanna put back? Yeah, shoot back. I should have killed him when I had a chance. Who? Her, so you oh. all in all for her. Yeah, I will cost three to pass her. Right. Okay. It's getting a little hot in here. Five life. It's getting a little hot. I hold the upper hand right now, but it's right now. And you have right 38 now. life to, to flex with. I don't have that much flexibility. I know. Okay. The thing is, if you ultimate again, I'm not like, that's why I don't want to put anything out, because you, you can ultimate again next turn and then take everything from me. I could. I could. But no one knew, you probably would too. Maybe. No, I'm pretty sure you would. I don't know. You don't know me. You ain't my mom. Man, I've known you for like three months now, four months now. <laughs> Yeah. Past turn. Past turn. All right, cool. Okay, 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 okay. <clears throat> okay, um, oh boy, well, you can start something. Okay. okay, I'm gonna be safe. One, okay. two, three, four, five. Tap you. Tap you. Colorless. Black. Okay. Three. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna get 13, two, two, black zombie tokens off the path. One. Uh, two. Well, oh, three. Damn. This just happened. Three. That's just so I'm safe. Scry one. Scry two. Put them on the bottom. Put any number that. Oh, yeah. I'll put these in the bottom of my library. Don't care about those. Here's where my deck comes into play. I'm manipulating what I want. I'm drawing what I want. It's finally coming in. I love it. Okay, cool. Plus, so now she's a six. Draw a card. Don't want, uh, I did not put a land down. So I'll choose you. Put one of you back. What do I not care about? That's how you work. Didn't have land down. Put a land down. Doesn't matter. I will attack. So, Flying Vigilance Menace. Swings for three. 
Deal three damage. Cool. Reveal a top card. Okay. I know what it is because I put it there. It's three mana. It comes into the field. The ninja. Yeah. Which technically her ability doesn't target that way, but it's the only thing that I can for free summon. Right. And I have it. Right. Pastor. Uh. That was a huge breath. Oh, this is tap. Okay. All right. Cool. All that happened. All that happened. Okay. I need you to smile more. I'm destroying you. Be content of my torture towards you. You have a 1-1 one, one token. Dang shit. <laughs> yeah, you can resummon him. It yeah, just I know. Cost one more colorless. Yeah, but all I need is you ultimate next turn, and then you take control of my commander. No, because then you get all of my stuff. How's that work? We switch the board. That's his. That's her ability. That's her ult oh. for minus six. I ain't giving you my stuff. I could have not told you that, but then that would be completely unfair. That would have been that. That would have been like a douchey thing to do, like cheating. That really would have. Like, been. like if someone would have cheated. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I want to play Mardu Rough Rider. Ooh, Mardu. When Mardu Rough Rider attacks, target creature can't block this turn. Okay. Fortunately, it doesn't have haste. I'm so if it had haste, and it would have been probably a rare instead of uncommon. Probably, yeah. It would have been a rare if it had haste, for sure. And it would have been awesome. It would have been awesome. It is awesome. It's still an awesome card. Because the fact that it can't block would mean like straight five damage, and you're just like. <sighs> yeah, right? Yeah. Faster. Okay. All right. Untap all my babies first. All the babies. All the babies. Ooh. All the babies. Okay. All the defense, guys. All the defense. <sighs> There's no reason to not up you. I'll, yeah, I'm gonna up you just so I can see what I draw next. Uh, I'll put you back. Two. Okay, put this bad boy down. The player chooses a number of lands they control equal to the number of lands they control. The player who has the fewest lands then sacrifices the rest. Players discard cards and sacrifice creatures the same way. That's a board wipe. Yes, it is. That is a complete board wipe. Okay, I'm swinging you with everything. So that's two, okay. four, six. Are you gonna eight. block anything? Yeah, I'm just gonna block whatever the biggest one is with this one one. The so that'll be one of the TTs. Okay, so that gets ignored. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty, one, twenty, two, twenty, three. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. 35. 35 example. Alright, well then, I'm on the block. Yeah, block, block anyone. You can kill this guy if you need to. Yeah, I'm gonna kill that guy. Okay. So the adjustment down to what, like 30? You, uh, you're, th you're at 1 HP, because it, it has 1 power. And depends on the next card I draw. Whether I want you can get Exodia. Uh, I, I need, there's a card I need to hear that could. Help me win the game. Okay, get that card. Oh, this should be tapped. I should be tapped out. Oh, dang. I, yeah. Oh, baby. And that was my mistake. I should have killed her. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed episode three of Tabletop Commands. We have more episodes coming your way, so stay tuned for that. And as always, hit the like button and subscribe. That lets us know that you want more content from us, more episodes, and to keep on doing this. Don't, don't do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. Unless it's cocaine. No, not even cocaine. Do cocaine. Don't listen to him. He's do a bad it. influence. Do it. Fucking do it. He's a bad influence. Fucking He's a bad fuck influence on all me. Fucking, fucking do it. Fucking no, do shush, it. shush. Later, guys. Adios.